Hi everyone, welcome to the Tim Tilt channel and this is my take on Praying Mantis as a Pet Revisited So basically uh, after my first video of having the Praying Mantis as a pet um, it has been uh, 14 days after that um, when I did that uh, it, uh, the Praying Mantis was already on its uh, 30th day with me so uh, so it's after 14 days so right now it would be 44 days um, on its 30th day um, it shed its uh, third skin uh, it would be the third time that it has shed its skin um, so now on its 44th it has shed another one um, if in case you're wondering <laughs> Um, the praying man, where the praying mantis is, it's hang, uh, it's hanging upside down from, from, from the cap of the, the plastic bottle. Um, it's, I'm not sure if it's clear to you guys, but it's on the upper right. Um, so, um, that's where it usually stays. Um, but for now, I'm going to show it to you. Uh, this is the skin that where it has molted from, and uh, that's from the 44th day. This one, this is the old one, it's from its 30th day, and uh, as you can see, the change that has happened on to the uh, the soil that I was able to place previously. Um, the the plant um, uh, it has wilted it has dried up it's now color black but if you can see here um, I'll just point it out this one it's trying to sprout um, new um, uh, small leaves already so hopefully it would be a lot um, when it grows uh, for several more days so that um, it would become greener um, on its uh, on the terrarium that I have created and there is our mantis it's hanging upside down it's where it's always been though I did notice that when it's hungry that it does move a lot a bit uh, it does move a lot um, when it's hungry or when I haven't fed it for a long time um, previously when I um, I stated that I will try to uh, to change the frequency of its uh, food uh, food intake. Well, I did not do that. Uh, I tried to. Um, I, I I tried to to change the frequency to about uh, giving it food for three to four days, every three to four days, but. I did notice that its belly or the stomach it's really getting flat uh, I did notice that uh, uh, not giving it food for every day does make the uh, the mantis um, uh, have the, uh, the the stomach or the belly to be uh, some sort of deflated uh, so uh, I was thinking and I, I do notice him moving around the uh, the terrarium a lot it seems like that uh, it's looking or trying to hunt for food that's why it's doing that but okay it's moving right now because I, I tried to move the uh, the, uh, the 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 bottle or the terrarium that I have created and I do notice that it's trying to nimble on something. 
and I just noticed right now that there are I'm not sure if you're seeing this I'll point it out uh, there there's a, a dot or a speck there's another speck here that's hanging and there's another speck there and there there are specks or dots that you could see from the video I didn't notice that it seems like uh, the, those are small spiders hanging uh, it has created a web uh, uh, it seems like uh, maybe I have placed a, um, a spider previously and it seems like it has hatched eggs so it might be eating them uh, I, it is finished right now though it's still trying to move its mouth uh, if you could if you're able to see it uh, though it's, it's very small so it would be very quick for him and I did notice uh, there's an ant there which is outside the the uh, the bottle or the terrarium and uh, when I was talking about the uh, the specks or the dots that I was able to see uh, which were not dots or dirt in the uh, the terrarium but rather small spiders I did notice that the mantis tried to grab the uh, the ant which was outside the the uh, the terrarium I think it might be hungry though I did give it uh, a spider a while ago uh, this morning um, it might be hungry due to that it has molten um, from what I've read that um, a mantis might be hungry after it has molded molted because um, um, before it molts it does not eat for a day or two but I did not notice this from this praying mantis uh, because I, I said a while ago that I tried to change its food intake uh, for uh, that I'd just give it uh, a food for three or four every three or four days but I did not do that so I still give it food uh, every day um, and he eats it uh, the um, no sorry she eats it uh, from what I have learned it seems like this is a female mantis I have discussed that on uh, my previous video as well so um, it seems like uh, this mantis really has an appetite um, and though I have aside from spiders I'm able to catch flies right now and um, uh, I have given it uh, several flying insects which I do not know what they are uh, though I have also tried uh, I was able to fortunately catch two very small um, grasshoppers and uh, he was able to catch it um, also not sure why but these flying insects or all of the other insects uh, not, not all of the insects um, most some of the spiders do stay away from him um they try to 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 build a uh, a spider web um away from the uh, the mantis they try to steer clear of him N though not all but some but for the flying insects i'm not quite sure what they're thinking they usually try to to rest near the mantis or they fly or they hover in front of the mantis it's like they're just saying hey i'm here come on get me so whenever i put uh flying insects uh it doesn't take long for the mantis to grab it um i just have to to watch uh less uh watch it for about less than five minutes and uh, the mantis would be able to get it um, even though the uh, the insects, those flying insects, um, drop or uh, rest near him, uh, he doesn't automatically grab it. 
uh, he's he just stay put, uh, stay still, and uh, he tries to grab it after the. Uh, I think it really waits for the uh, for the insect, for the flying insect to settle. Uh, once it has felt that um, there's no danger, that's the time when the mantis strikes. That's what I noticed. Though, th really, I, I really could not get over it. But those flying insects, I don't know what they're thinking about. But they really rest or fly or hover over the mantis. Uh, also, I was uh, fortunately able to get a, a bee one time. I was able to to give it to him. Um, I did notice when he eats a bee, uh, the last thing that he eats is the uh, the stinger. Um, usually, because uh, I did notice um, uh, some would say, or from what I have read, that the you uh, once they grab something, they hold on to it, and then bites uh, off its head, so that it would not put up much of a fight. But from what I have noticed, uh, he does grab it. Uh, the insects are not able to to get out, though they try to to flinch or uh, use its feet to kick uh, the mantis. But um, the mantis just bites it or grabs, uh, eats it uh, to the part where it's nearest to. Uh, that's what I notice. Even if it's uh, within the belly or the uh, the thorax or the the head, it doesn't matter. Uh, from that's based from uh, this mantis that I have right now. Um, there. Uh, so um, uh, this is the uh, uh, I think the, the fourth time that it has molted, and uh, based on the growth, it it, uh, it did not double, but I think it grew more than one fourth, more than one fourth of its original size. It grew that big. There, it's trying to clean up its uh, what do you call that mandibles, or or its uh, th those praying hands or feet. Um, uh, so that's it for an update with the uh, pr uh, having the praying mantis as a pet. Uh, hopefully, these plants, the the ones that are sprouting, would grow faster so that it would be a bit green again within the ter uh, terrarium and uh, so that it would look nicer because it looks like a barren land right now um, doesn't look enticing it's just twigs here and dry soil though not that dry it still has some moist but I think it's time for me to to put or spray water so as you can see here because uh, the last time I I put a lot of uh, water in it so it's now having molds inside uh, those white stuff yeah those are molds so uh, just to have an idea on how much it grew this is the uh, the third molt and this is the fourth and this is how he was from its size and this is how he is now there so let's try to see if we could open the uh, the hatch um, though sometimes he oh, okay wait 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 a minute I see some action it's moving there is a it clear there's a small spider here that one in front of him okay it's trying to move uh, was it agitated by my finger or there's also an ant here I'm not sure if it's trying to, to move for a kill even for those small insects we'll try to see 
Okay, let's try to wait for several seconds and try to see. Oh no, the ant did not move in. Okay, let's try to force the ant to move in. Go, go ant. Go inside. Okay, it's inside. Let's try to see if it will strike. Uh, there, uh, you might have seen the ant. Is it outside? Ah, uh, it is outside. So he would not be able to take it. Uh, there, he moved again. I think he's seeing the ant. It's just that it's outside. So he's trying to move for it. I think he's intrigued. Oh, the spider is also moving. The small spider. Um, so those could be some appetizers for him. Um, uh, it's just that I'm seeing several small spiders here. Uh, I don't think that they will grow as I think the, uh, the mandas will eat them before it grows bigger. And uh, it doesn't have no, doesn't have food inside the uh, the terrarium, so I don't think they would live that long as well. Even if the mantis does not eat them, well, I guess that's it for the uh, the update on this mantis. Hopefully that it just tries to go down. Um, as you can see, it's really long right now. Um. He has, uh, and also the span of his legs, it's very wide right now. Um, though I'm still not into holding him. Uh, I don't know what's keeping me um, from holding or trying to have him on my palms. Uh, though I have read and seen some videos that people are able to train them to move or to fly about uh, from one hand to the other uh, I was thinking of doing that though I'm not sure if, uh, if I would want that really want that I mean though uh, looking at its uh, backside uh, I was also looking if it has already grown wings but doesn't seem to have one yet though there are some sort of hint that it's trying to open up or trying to have some maybe uh because uh what was it uh six or seven molts before it becomes an adult but it looks like an adult to me um so uh, i guess that would be it for the revisit uh the uh praying mantis as a pet so um so do just stay tuned for uh, the next video um hopefully i would still be able to take care of this mantis properly and have him grow and uh let's wait so thanks for watching and have a great day bye